Thank you for becoming a member. Thank you, Dragon Dance 05, for becoming a level 4 member. Thank you, Toost, for becoming a level 4 member. Thank you, Mansor, for taking that extra step and going to level 2. Thank you, Shuvier Data 9978, for going that extra step to level 2. Thank you, The Seventh Legend, for going that extra step and going to level 2. Thank you to all my level 1 members who will stick around even though they don't watch most of my streams. I really appreciate your support. Xavier McKnight, Bradello 2, Plasma CE, Dino Boy. Thank you all for becoming members of this channel. If you guys want to support my streams, you can become a member by hitting that join button or the link in the description down below. You will get some member badges and emojis and all other cool stuff as well. Make sure you guys check the perks whenever you join. What's going on you guys and welcome to a new video. Today I'm going to be unboxing the Split Pad Pro full size controller for handheld mode. And it's officially licensed by Nintendo as you can see right here with my pointer, <laughs> pointer finger. You got the Hori brand right there, very nice. And it's got the Nintendo Switch logo right there. Nintendo Switch, it's a really nice box. It's a lot like the official Nintendo stuff uh, will be packaged, which is really nice. And on the back here, you can see you have some uh, full-sized buttons. You got a precision D-pad. We got programmable rear triggers, so you can program these buttons to be a, not a button, whatever button you want to do. Anyway, I think that's good. That's the information. There's not a lot more information. It's a lot like the Switch box, actually, which I'm a big fan of. I'm going to use this disgusting knife. Sorry about that. Be careful. Don't want to ruin the box and cut away from yourself, guys, okay? I did not ruin the box as much as I can. A bit of a bend, but that's fine. Alright, it's got a similar package set up like the actual Switch console. Let's pull this out. Alright, this was lighter and the box is smaller than I thought it would be. And you know. Got the two pro con joy cons. Oh, these are pretty cool, huh? They're they're literally just the pro controller, but joy con style. And you can see the 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 clip or whatever you want to call it on the side to make it connect to your console. I recently bought these because I think most of my joy cons drift, so I wanted some. These are bigger than I thought they would be. That's awesome. It's gonna be so much easier to play, you know, games. So let me actually grab my Switch real quick and I'll put it on. Okay. There we go. So here's my Nintendo Switch. It's pretty disgusting, sorry about that. I'm gonna use this for modding later. Oh wait, wrong way. Okay, how do I not? Okay, there we go. Very nice, this is very strong as well can really hold the weight of the console. You could probably just buy these. And they actually like connect and hold the console really well. You can see it actually is, uh, sees them as a gray Joy-Cons, which is pretty cool. Which means they're like, what you call it? I really should have cleaned my, my Switch. I, I, don't, I don't know. But they're pretty sweet. So, uh, Basically, Toost reminded me of these. Uh, I've seen these long ago. Got the back buttons. And you can actually assign the buttons. Interesting. Let's see if the game actually boots. It's pretty flush with the the Switch, honestly. I, need, I never play portable. That's why my Switch is so disgusting. I never clean it. <laughs> but here we have Animal Crossing. All right, let's jump in. Don't know why the brightness is so low on my switch. That's strange. I might have it on the lowest brightness or maybe because there's lights shining at me. All right. So yeah. Let's see if it uh, actually does anything. You can actually see my, my phone <laughs> set up here. <laughs> okay, is it gonna load today maybe? Jeez, Animal Crossing is so slow at loading right now for some reason. Very, very slow. 
Oh, here we go. Here we go. We got Isabel. I want to get a feel for them. I might actually play some Smash Bros. after this video to see if they're really good. And uh, so far, I think uh, Toos is a big fan of them. So that's pretty cool. And I think I might be a fan because it's better when it, the stick is not right, right below the buttons, like on the Joy-Cons. Instead, it's by the side. So it's easier to get to. But from what I can tell, it's super awesome. But I got a feeling these are only for when they're connected, right? I think so. Because there's nothing else to connect these together. But these are mainly for those who play handheld a lot. You need some powerful controllers. And these Horicons are beautiful and very awesome. And I'm really excited to be able to play uh, in handheld mode without feeling all the pain and suffering in my hands <laughs> whenever I use <laughs> this sort of stuff. But this is pretty cool. Pretty cool. It's a pretty awesome uh, controller, honestly. Let's actually play some Smash Bros. I have it over here. Hmm. It's a pretty interesting experience. Uh, I'm too used to the GameCube buttons. Oh, getting lag. Oh. Of course, I'm getting lag. Ah, my god, this guy has the worst lag. Is it him or just me? I'm not sure. But this is a perfect Smash Bros. controller. Okay, so sorry, I'm gonna focus on the fight right now. Oh boy, no! <laughs> oh boy, this lag is unbearable though. Well, this guy, is it him or am I having the worst lag right now? Oh, there we go. Dang. Wait, did I just knock him once? I thought I already knocked him out. I guess I was wrong. Oh, he sure likes... Oh my god. Well, I'm terrible. I'm gonna have to try to get better, because I'm too used to the GameCube uh, button layout. So... I think I'll get better some way. I don't know. Maybe? Maybe not? I don't know. You tell me. Anyway, so... That's it for this video, and I highly recommend these out of the box. Just try them. They're really fun to use for Smash Bros. They're probably really fun to use over all a bunch of other games that you might want to use them for. But that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. And tell me guys what you think about this new table look. Because I decided to put something on this table to make it look nicer. Oh, I'm moving it. Sorry. Alright. So do I recommend this? Yes. Should you buy it? Well, it depends on if you have the money for it. I'm going to put the Amazon link in the description. So you guys can go and buy it. And uh, uh, I'm not sure how the affiliate thing works. But maybe I can actually get money from you guys buying this. But anyways. I'll see you guys in the next unboxing video. Have an awesome rest of your day. Leave a like. And comment down below what you guys think of this video. And what you want to see me unbox next. It depends on what I will buy of course. That's it. I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.